All right, guys, welcome to episode 92 of Dope Talk TV. It's yours truly low key. Got John here with me, got Jay over here. Yo. Remy being a piece of shit. You already know how the fuck we're rocking, man. We appreciate everybody that's rocking, liking, sharing, subscribing. Don't forget to do just that. Go down in the description, get yourself some merch. And listen, man, only about fucking 15% of y'all are subscribed, right? So just hit that subscription. Just hit that subscription button. Hit the notification hit bell every fucking time so you're notified. All hit, right? Hit we're back bitch. with another one. We're feeling good, we're looking good. Hey, yeah. how y'all boys feeling today? <laughs> oh, we chilling, man. Fucking, mm-hmm. it's a beautiful day. Uh, a beautiful woke up, day. positive vibes. I had a great weekend. Uh, I just want to um, say that John's fucking lying. He he's didn't a lying wake up with sack positive of shit. vibes because yeah. he's a piece of shit. He fucking woke up <laughs> trying to fight everybody. Mm-hmm. Right? I thought I was gonna get hit when yeah, I walked yeah. into the door. I thought he was gonna flip a chair. He came out naked almost from the bathroom. Yeah, I did. sweating. I did. No I shower. Yeah, yeah, no, I couldn't no, even no. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it was a hot shower. Fuck out of here, guys. It was a hot one. The water didn't yeah. even work, and he came out drenched, so nah, go I figure. Go fucking figure. I came out drenched. I was ready to go. Mm. It was a fucking... Whoa. I was ready to go, man. That's all. That's all you guys need to know. That's, that's all it. you need to know. That's all you need to. Hey, you hear my dog? That's all you need to know out there. That's all it. right. That's it. Look, that's we're, it. we're having a beautiful fucking beautiful fucking day. My yeah. boy's smoking his blunt. Yeah, man. Light your blunt. Light you know your chay. You know what I'm saying? Pack your bomb. Pack your ball. All that good shit. I forgot to say that, but go ahead and do that right now. You know what I'm saying? While we get into the first little topic that we're getting into, uh, obsession versus love. Right? Yeah. Some people think that. Somebody's in love with them because they chase them, whatever. Like they, they, they're always after them and shit like that. Yeah. But sometimes it's not love, man. Sometimes that shit's real obsession. Yeah. And I bring that up because there was a Deltona man that was killed in a in a case, bro, where it was a uh, a Windermere hedge fund hedge fund manager. Hedge fund. He's a hedge. Oh, He's a hedge. Fuck that guy. First crafted a detailed murder plan for killing his romantic rival mm-hmm. by injecting him with a lethal dose of drugs. But in the end, Gregory Bender instead gunned down the young man at his home in Deltona with a ruse about a package delivery. So this piece Jesus. of shit. So he was gay. So this is not a guy and a girl. It's a guy. No, a no, guy. no. It was about a girl. But the guy was older. This guy was older. The, yeah. uh, the, oh, the other guy okay, was 25. Okay. okay. Yeah, yeah. So his chick mm-hmm. left him and started dating the 25 year old. Okay, okay. Yeah. How old how old is this guy? This guy's like forty something. So he's older. He's older. Yeah, yeah. He's, he's older. older. Okay. He's Damn, 53. That's, crazy. that's wild. You know what? Uh, fifty three. Mo- Monchin Alexandra said it best. <laughs> no es amor, es obsesión. <laughs> Facts. Yo, no no es, es amor. amor. Yo, my mom my mom hates that voice. I don't know why. Bro, that's I think it's, I think it's beautiful. Yeah, she's like, ah, I hate her. Like, it's just, it's, it's just annoying. I was like, damn, amazing, bro. I think it's amazing too. It's amazing. Matter it's of fact, yeah, it's round of applause for the voice. Shout out to you. Shout out to you. She screams a lot though. Hey, she be, she be, she be screaming. Fun. Yeah, she <laughs> screams. <laughs> <laughs> I know he, I don't he's see any fucking Yo, these people are probably like, oh, this guy doesn't know what the fuck that bitch is. Nah, man. facts. Nah, I know but now, nah, listen, guys, the main the main thing that I was trying to get to, the main point is be careful who you're dealing with. Um, be careful who you start dating. You know what I'm saying? If somebody's fresh out of a relationship, make sure you know the whole truth. Don't just jump head first in the sun because people get people die <laughs> over sh- stupid shit like this all the time. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like to you, that's just the girl, the new girl you're dating, but to him, that's been his wife for the last 15, 20 years. Yeah, you got And he's not fucking playing. Shit. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. Like yeah. that's why, like, as as men, bro, you gotta be careful where you stick your dick. You know what I'm saying? Be careful mm. where you stick your dick, bro. That's true. Straight up. You gotta be careful. Mm. Straight the fuck up. You gotta be careful. But yeah, man. <laughs> again, yeah, but being careful, bro. You got to be careful receiving information, man. Receiving information is important. You know what I'm saying? Um, If it's information that could be applied to your life, if it's information that could be applied to your personal situation, then in my opinion, I say, you know what I'm saying? Like, take it and apply it. If it's not, don't waste your time trying to apply it because it's not for you. But uh, it's important. It's important. You got to listen to the people around you. You got to listen to, you know, people that know what they're talking about people that are doing what you're doing exactly. and you guys are yeah. trying to grow together and shit like that because if you don't bro like you're not gonna grow yeah there's, just being a sponge yeah. yeah there's gonna be no growth bro did like, you, you say penis punch it. i said penis punch and also said sponge we're not sponge drinking any of that yeah. well i might later <laughs> after the podcast. I mean, I don't know. 
<laughs> no, nah, but this the day's nah, young. I don't know what the fuck I said, but listen, guys, I'm I'm gonna be a sponge. I'm gonna learn everything as possible. Like I'm gonna learn everything. That's, yeah, that's nah, the facts. goal. That's the goal. You know what I mean? Because sometimes we get in our head. I'm like, hey, man, I think I know it all and shit. And it's mm-hmm. like, nah, bro, I, I, don't, you gotta, I don't. I you don't. You gotta know listen. You gotta listen to different perspectives. You know, and figure out yeah. what's like I just said what's best for you. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? For example, like stocks. You know, stocks is one of those things where it's like. There's different ways of dealing with it. It's like there's just like there's different ways of do, dealing with money. Yep. Like there's day trading, then there's you know compound interest. Like yeah. you you study what you want to fuck. Like you study both, and then you choose the 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 way that feels best for you to yep. do it. You know what I'm saying? Like and going back like to receiving information, man. You got to be willing to be open minded, bro. Like you can't let pride get in the way of you just receiving some information because you might miss out on a, a you know opportunity of a lifetime like yep. when you told me about amc yeah i slept on it for like a week but then i fucking put it in because i was like bro like well I'm, i mean you know bro, I'm saying? Like, I'm, that shit no it's true because i slept on it as well because kane told me about a week of like a week before i actually got it yeah you know and i was just takes... like yo i could have got it way more cheaper but yeah. i didn't listen because i was hard-headed and now he and tells me he's happens. like yo don't you wish you would have put more money don't you wish because you were that's you were fighting me you were like oh bro you got this music video dropping and shit and I'm like, bro, now I got my music video quadruple paid. Paid for, yeah. Because, <laughs> because I listened to him. You see Sex. what I'm saying? I, I, made, I made $700 in three, four days. Right. I checked my account. I'm, it's down, and I still am positive $700, which is pretty incredible if you ask me. Nah, bro, it, that's amazing. Some people don't make yeah. that shit going to work. Yeah. So the fact that you made that off of a little investment, man, that's amazing. But it's like, yeah, you're right, bro. Like, sometimes we're hard-headed, and we don't want to listen and whatever. Like... Bro, regardless of where the information comes from, if it's good information, you should use it. Yep. You should apply it. Absolutely. Straight up. 100% but right. Something that I want to apply in my life is uh, is exactly what McDonald's did, bro. Like, McDonald's is one of those companies where a lot of people think that all they do is just, like, make burgers or something <laughs> like that. And that's not the case at all. Like, McDonald's is literally the biggest real estate company in the world. Like... <laughs> the way they do it is they buy property. They own the most important and expensive corner lots in cities all around the world. It's all real estate. It's, not it's even all about real the estate. Yeah. It's not about the food. But the way they sell the real estate is, hey, man, we'll give you a restaurant with it. So when you buy the franchise, you're also buying that piece of land. Okay. So that's how McDonald's pays zero dollars in taxes a year. And they make so much, so much money. That's incredible. Because That's as crazy. long as you keep investing into more real estate, yeah, you, they can't tax that. And you know they what's crazy? It's your, like your profits. It's like talk about a shitty fucking customer service, huh? I mean, you could literally forget an item, and I'm still gonna come back next week. Facts. Like it's like that. Like let's keep it a buck. Like I like fucking, <laughs> I like Big Macs, and I'm gonna come back. Like if you forget nah, the I'm fries or you forget the sweet tea, and you know I'll what's get happened. it next time. You know what's happened <laughs> to all of us. You know what happened. I don't care, <laughs> bro. There's not one person in this fucking world that said, "Hey, you know what, AJ? Uh, yo, bro, they forgot my fries. I'm never going fucking back." Or somebody that's never fucking. Nah, I'm going back right there. <laughs> like I need my yeah. fucking fries. I paid for. They more. forgot my chicken and a chicken sandwich before. You yeah. You see what I'm saying? Get the fuck out of I here. got home and I told Ivy, I was like, yo, what the fuck is missing here from <laughs> yo, the sandwich? I, I yeah. ordered from Steak and Shake. They only gave me a fucking a plain ass. They didn't even put lettuce. Now this guy, <laughs> yo, I, this guy <laughs> has <laughs> the worst fucking luck when it comes to doing anything drive through, anything about going out to eat at all. This nigga order a steak with some fries and they'll bring him some chicken Alfredo. Oh, no, our no, fault. No. Oh, fucking. <laughs> that's funny. I just got chicken Alfredo last night. No, but that's, it's crazy, man. Um, it's true. I, I really don't know what's going on with that. I, every time I go out to eat, it's something. It's literally something. Maybe maybe the fucking person will be like, oh, you're, you're a Gemini. Because they check my ID because I'm a fucking... <laughs> <laughs> and then they give me fucking shitty drinks for the rest of the fucking night because their ex was a fucking Gemini. Oh Yo, God. cut that shit out. Bro, nobody... Out. Hey, if you bro, care that much just, about that shit, like, it literally you're happened. probably still like 19 Yo, you can, Yo, you can ask... <laughs> like, you, can, for real. you can literally yeah, ask man. Justin. I went out the other night, bro, with him. It was for his birthday, actually. We went out. And that was, we went out to Duffy's. I remember the restaurant. It was in Heathrow. Duffy's. Duffy's, yeah. Duffy's. Shout out Fucking to you, Duffy's. Duffy's. Round of applause to Duffy's. Is it Duffy's or? Yeah, it's Duffy's. Yep. I don't fucking know. Yeah. You what? Well, it's Duffy's. <laughs> it's, it's fucking Duffy's. Something like that, right? And fucking, that, that's what happened. I literally ordered a drink. She asked for my ID and I fucking, 
<laughs> and she's like, oh. <laughs> Gemini, huh? I was like, wow. I mean, you don't even know me. I mean, I. Just, uh, that says like, everything we need to know. You're a piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> you're a piece of shit. Am I Two pe- colors. Am I a piece of- Damn. That's now, crazy. you're a good guy, but you have those moments like we all do. Yeah. No, 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 no. He's a piece but, of shit. But John, yeah, John <laughs> has those moments a lot. Right? Yeah, yeah. He has them a lot. Six yeah. days out of the week. But now, nah, listen. Uh, Casey Anthony, jumping straight into it. Yeah. Right? Well. Fuck that bitch. I have no idea how she got off of that. There was they want to free yeah, there her was and, pretty and lock much up Cosby. The, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Bro, let that man out. Stop playing <laughs> nah, with me. Facts. That's crazy. Like I don't understand how you beat a case like that. I mean, I do. Money, lawyers, whatever. And vagina, because I heard she slept with a lawyer. Yeah. I'm just saying that. Allegedly, allegedly, she slept with allegedly. her with her uh, with her lawyer. Allegedly, but <laughs> gave him that. Pool I don't money. put I don't put nothing past nobody, bro. Like I, be, she probably did. And nice. she probably, I heard her dad, you know, her dad, up, her dad, hey, yeah. fuck her, her parents yeah. too, bro. To me, bro, bro, Before. them motherfuckers are like, they helped her cover that up, bro. Hell yeah. Her parents helped her cover up the murder allegedly. of her own grandchild, bro. Nah. I mean, yeah, me. allegedly, <laughs> but that's how I fucking feel about it. Like, damn. Now, nah, I really, we all know you did, like, look, look, we, we got to keep it a buck here, guys. Florida's full of crazy people, full of weird ass. No, it's not. Well, yes, Florida's it is. not. Florida's yes, like is. the least craziest state. Oh, that's fucking bullshit. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> fucking, we got some crazy <laughs> motherfuckers. You see here. people with air conditioning units, household ones in their back seat coming out the back window. When I first seen that, that was some meme shit. I could have made a meme, and I saw somebody with hey, a, a home unit yeah. hanging out their back window of their crusty ass car. I'm like, say, see, hey, Florida's different, Facts. bro. That shit's heavy as fuck, bro. You know how heavy air conditioning. If that shit fell on the highway, forget about fine. it. It'll be fine. It'll be all right. We're all dying. Nah, it's Florida. Shout out it's to you, Florida. <laughs> nah, man. But this, this, it just shows. It just shows that money talks. First of all, in this world, and second, yeah. um, the justice system is not actually like really good it's actually pretty shitty no way bro yeah. our justice isn't nah, so it's great perfect. Yeah. What do you mean? There's yeah. nothing we have the best justice system. system in the world it's so fair it's so fair <laughs> what happened to getting what happened to people getting like stoned to death and shit like that yeah bring like, back the firing squads no nah, yeah i i, f- I agree mm-hmm, like mm-hmm. the people that be shooting shit up public execution hey, the same way you did the same way you yeah. let somebody yeah. fucking Absolutely. go out you're going up yeah you know what i'm saying yeah like, Straight the fuck up. Nah, bro. Like, I don't know, man. I just don't understand how certain people get away with certain things. If you guys agree with that, like, go down in the comments. Let us know how you feel about that Casey Anthony case. And um, Do you think she was a great person? Yeah. Do you think she actually did it? Do you think that we're just judging her? Like, y'all let us know. Let us us know. Let us know. Let us know. But, hey, Mike. I'm gonna say Mine. something right quick, man. Listen, man. Shout out to Soldier Boy, man. Soldier, hey, y'all keep Soulja playing Boy with Big Draco. Soldier. <laughs> Soldier Boy. Y'all keep playing with Big Soldier like he wasn't yeah. the first to do it all. Mm. All right? Mm. Nah, he wasn't do it all. Mm. He done a lot. Hey, bro. Nah, listen. Look, first listen. one to blow up on YouTube. He was the first one to blow up on YouTube. He was the first one to make a fucking TikTok dance before there was even a fucking TikTok. Fuck you, TikTok. He was the first one to fucking start gaming and Twitch streaming and shit like that out of the rappers and shit. Yeah. Like, he did. He, I'm no he cap. He did Drake a lot, on. bro. He put Drake on pretty much. Like, he bro, created he wrote Drake. for Drake. If there wouldn't have been Soldier Boy, right? There'd be no Drake. If it wasn't for Soldier Boy, there'd be no Drake. But you know what I'm saying? Hey, hey, he caught his ass with that one line. You remember? Tell me. I'm really going on. And then, and then Soldier. Yeah, yeah, yeah bro. Yeah, what yeah, happened? Fuck you. Hey, Drake. yo, Drake, you got to explain that, bro. Yeah. Like, he might have really put you on. Yeah, I mean, yeah, that is. So tell me mm-hmm. what's really going mm-hmm. on. Jersey back up in this thing. I'm ready. Yeah, what's happening? Oh, 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 me and now I'm back again. Nah, but that first bar, mm-hmm. that's Soldier. Yeah. That's Big Soldier. <laughs> that's <Draco>. Draco. <laughs> Yeah. Big Draco. Hey, nah, for real though. Round of applause to Soldier Boy, bro. Soulja that nigga Boy did it. He did it on a different level when Shout he was out. young. When mm. he sold like a bajillion fucking ringtones. Yeah. When that shit was a thing. Yeah. Like <clears throat> ringtones. A dollar ring ringtone. Tones? When you would call and you could hear the music. Yeah. Like, enjoy this song while you wait for your party yeah. to pick up. And it was, fuck bitches get money. Fuck. <laughs> that was mine when I was like 12. No, it's good. <laughs> <laughs> nah, bro, it was fucking lit. It was nah, a different was, time back yeah. then. But nah, real talk though. Shout out, soldier. Shout out, people might hate, but hey, 
Soldier we see you, Draco. Boy, we see you over here. Draco. All right? But, nah, man. Stock market, John. Stock market. Stock market. Yo, I want to tell you what, man. We were just talking about AMC earlier, and I want to get back into it. I want to jump back into Let's it. Let's get it. Let's get it. I want to jump because guess what? I took a jump and I took a leap. I didn't know where the fuck I was going to go. And Up guess or what? down? And guess what? I went up 700 fucking dollars. So, Facts. Yeah. Round of applause yeah. to my fucking guy. Hey, yeah. listen, man. If you ever done it, playing with stocks a little bit, made a little bit of bread, you know it's a good feeling, man. And you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm happy for you, bro. Because it's, yeah. I'm telling you, man, holding is the key, though. Holding is the key. Like, with certain stocks, you know what I'm saying? You want to get in and get out at the right time. But, like, how we were talking about yesterday, like, in my opinion, to, to build wealth, like, real wealth, bro, it, it's got to be over a long period of time. Oh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, you should Good play shot. with both. Like, play with both, though. You know what I'm saying? Like pick stocks that you can make a quick dollar off of, yep. and then invest that money into stocks that are for the long run. Like, because ultimately, man, like 30, 40, there's stocks right now that ain't worth shit, and they won't be worth shit for the next 10, 15 years. But in 20, 25, 30 years, those stocks are going to be through the fucking roof. Very I'm true. telling you, bro. Yeah. Like, so just guys, do your research, you know what I'm saying? And ask people, ask people if you could get into a group. You know what I'm saying? Online, get into a group and and ask questions and, and relay information with other people that are doing the same thing, man. Straight up. Facts. Yeah, absolutely. I'm fucking high shit. I'm high yeah, shit. Too. I really want to smoke and spoon. I'm going to change mm. my genre. Mm, but I have yeah. no, oh yeah. Do you think fucking sorry guys? John writes like he wrote with his left foot. <laughs> yeah, we so have, we have a board him. I don't know what the um, fuck it was saying for a second. But listen, man, Jake Paul versus Mayweather. Jake, Jake Paul. Paul versus Mayweather. Look, man, Jake I'm gonna Paul. tell you my opinion about Wait, Jake no, Paul. No. Is it Jake Paul? What's it? What's is the other one? I think it's Logan. It's Logan Paul. It's Logan. Yeah, it's Logan Paul. Hey, one of they look the same to me. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, don't, I, I didn't know there was two. I thought right. it was just one. <laughs> Hey, look, all right, so my bad, Jake. My bad. Logan. Logan Paul. Is he the big one or the little one? I think he's the older one. He's the older one? Yeah, the yeah. little one's the one that just fought that other dude and just hit him, knocked him out. Jake guys. Paul's the older one? or No, he's the little one. Logan okay, okay, Paul's okay. The older. He okay. Has a podcast. So Logan right, Paul, right. man. Logan Paul, the older brother, is fighting Mayweather, right? My opinion about it is, do I feel that based off of his boxing career and potential, do I feel like he deserves a fight with Mayweather based off of that? No. I don't think he's at the level of Mayweather. Everybody fucking knows that. It's all about money. is he a marketing fucking genius? Hell yeah. Yes. So, of course, Mayweather's going to fucking... Bro, if you could guarantee... If you could guarantee Mayweather no less than $40 million, he's gone. That's a bat for a fucking a twenty minute fight because you know how it's gonna end. You know what I'm saying? Bro, like, the best of nobody the really best. thinks that Logan Paul could beat Mayweather. Let's be real, bro. The best of the best haven't been able to beat Mayweather. You see what I'm saying? Like, come on, bro. Come these on, niggas bro. that have trained their whole life to fight haven't been able to beat Mayweather. So you think this kid that's gonna train for what a year is gonna go in and, and fucking? Hey, we this? all know how it's gonna end, but it's about this. I'm gonna tell you what. All it takes is one fucking bunch. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> and if Mayweather's dumb ass goes in that ring, bro, and he goes out 50 and 1 with yeah. that one loss yeah. being a fucking Logan Paul, Logan Paul it's murder is going to be the sixth face on Mount Rushmore. I promise you that. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking promise you that. Jesus. I'm yo, telling you, bro. Nah, yo, man, Khabib, they offered him like five people have been wanting to fight Khabib. He's undefeated, too. And he's like, you know what? I come here. I come here to win. He's like, unless you're going to take King Kong and turn him into a man and bring him into the ring. He's like, bro, he's undefeated. He left undefeated. He retired already. But he's like, people are offering mad money. He's like, this week, five fight, I got offered over I don't know how many million. He's like, I'm not going. To fight who? Like, all these people are just throwing him money because they want him to come out of retirement to fight because they think they can beat him. But he's like, bro, he's like, I came to make history. He's like, I didn't come to fucking for money. Listen, man. Mm. Yeah, if, if it to me, that's how I would approach it. Yeah. Like the money's cool, but it's like, nigga, I'm go. Like if you're good with your money, you're good with your money. Yeah. So you're gonna be good. It's not gonna be about the bread. It's like if it don't make sense though. Yeah. Like if it's not a legacy fight, like it is what it is. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Sometimes it's, it's not all about money, man. Sometimes it's uh, just. It's just. I think it's just. Some people just get addicted to that publicity. And they just want to keep getting it, be in the limelight. You know what I mean? If that makes sense. Hey, know. man, there's a lot of speculation that Mayweather's going broke. <sighs> really? 
Yeah, I mean, yeah. Man, money, Bro, you, money you, spend, Mayweather? you know the overhead this nigga has a month? Per month? <gasps> it's like millions of dollars. Yeah, have you seen his car for like it's millions of dollars to maintain those cars, to maintain those houses, the mm-hmm. fucking workers he has, the bitches that he has in them houses. Yeah. They're not there because they, like, nigga, they're there because they're on payroll. Let's keep it real. He owns a strip club or some shit like that. But it's like, <laughs> I really feel like to keep up that, like, you could be rich, but Mayweather got used to being that nigga, money Mayweather. So... Probably in his head, bro, like, if you don't have that shit, all that shit, like, he's not really living it like that. Yeah, you know? damn. I don't know. That's probably what it is, because... I don't know. Trust don't me, know. bro. No, nah, the know. overhead on that nigga is fucking... He has, more money than, he has more money than me, though, so... I mean, he has more money than all of us, but <laughs> yeah. for his standards, he might be going broke. He might. Because they, standards, it makes no true. sense that to fight sense. him. It for makes him. no sense for him yeah. to fight that guy for that... I mean, yeah. it just don't. For his standards. Facts, because his standards is absolutely fucking crazy. That's what crazy. I mean. Yeah. It's millions of dollars a month. That's Every crazy. month that comes in, he has to pay a lot, bro. And that shit, I don't give a fuck if you have a hundred million. Yeah. If you got two million dollars that you're spending every month, you only got a couple years before you need to fucking re up on your money. If you're spending yeah. more than you're bringing in, which that's what it looks. That's like what in it his looks. Case. I mean, nigga, you got an eighteen million dollar watch. <laughs> 18 million why though why but think about that for what because somebody's gonna that. look at it and they're gonna be like oh how much that was 35 racks from Johnny Dang <laughs> <laughs> they're not gonna, <laughs> yeah. they're not like, gonna know no but it's facts they're mm-hmm. not gonna know that mm-hmm. that shit's that 18 until you say it how would they know how exactly they know? like nobody's in that league bro and a nigga that got 18 million dollars to spend on a watch probably isn't spending it on a watch that doesn't sound like like wise financial uh, knowledge. Who's you know? gonna buy that? Eighteen million. It's like ah oh, yeah. Be like, nigga, no. I'll give you. I give no, you hundred racks for it right now. Does it hold its no. value? It's eighteen million dollars. Think what you could do with eighteen. You million know what dollars. you could do with that? Like for real, bro. You could probably stop fucking homelessness in a couple states. I fucking smoke it. No cap. Nah, you could yeah. you could you could take that watch and you could fucking live off the rest of your fucking life. Nah, right? bro, you could take that watch, you could shove it up your fucking Fact. ass. Nobody Mayweather, cares, like, bitch. Like, like I don't want to hear shit. That's the <laughs> thing, bro. I don't know, bro. I feel like we we we're in an age where niggas just want to flex with what they yeah. got, and Ain't it's me. like who gives a <laughs> fuck if you're a piece of shit. You're a piece of shit, rich mm. or broke. Mm-hmm. That's mm. true. Money just magnifies who you. Yeah, truly are. like. That shit don't matter at the end of the day. Nobody cares. Because guess what? There, I'm telling you, man. There's a lot of niggas that are going to pass away, and they're super rich, and people ain't going to talk good about them. Like, it's not... Their families don't like them. You know what I'm saying? Like, a lot of shit. It's yeah, like, that's true. I didn't think about that. It, look, bro. Money don't make you or break you. Like, Ooh, Villa. Yeah, fucking soft. Yeah, bro. I'm going to give myself a round. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. I was going to say that. You beat me too. I, got, I, got a, I got a question for y'all boys, man. What up, bro? Yo, my voice cracked. You're in there. Ooh, I like that. It. Puberty. It's puberty. It's okay. Fucking. Um, Second round of puberty. I went to the beach yesterday. I know you noticed the tan. You know what I mean? We uh, did it. Yeah, okay. we did it. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I'm actually looking quite toasty today. So I don't know if y'all noticed. But I went out there and uh, I really like the beach. I don't know about y'all. What do you guys? Nah, I yeah. fucks at the beach, yeah, me man. Too. I fucks at the beach. I like bodies of water. I was just way hungover yesterday, and <laughs> I didn't go with him. But if not, I would have been there, bro. I that been he there. be hitting you in Florida hits different. Yeah, facts. The heat bro. here just hits different. I'm sorry. <laughs> nah, bro. That shit. It's hot, bro. But and when you're high, you go outside, and that heat hits you, and you feel <laughs> ten times higher. Like, whoa, holy fuck! The worst part is when you don't have shades, because then you yeah. you're like this. You're uh-huh. blind. You're you high. Can't, yeah, bro. Cotton mouth. You I'm get a- some sand in your eye, you're fucked. Just go home. <laughs> go home. Bye. Night, night. <laughs> go home. Yeah, bro. But do you guys like the city or you guys like the beach? <laughs> I like Fuck, the country, man. bro. I just like the fact. This is what I like about the country. This is the pros and cons for me. City, accessibility. Things close by. Whatever you want. Shit's country, over like 24-7. Yeah. Country, shit shuts down early. But you get privacy. You can do whatever the fuck you want. You can shoot guns. You can do bonfires. You can ride four-wheelers. You can fucking kill people. <laughs> you can nah, literally, like, yo, literally I, bury your money there no, no. <laughs> I agree man like I feel like 
you got the best of both worlds. Like you yeah, can live yeah. in the country and still live close enough yeah, somewhere to where that's me right you there. can go somewhere. <laughs> you have a good night out. Yeah. I've always told you yeah, that. Like, thanks. I'll go have a you know go to a lounge, a grown man fucking lounge, lounge no, not club. a we club. Don't do clubs. That's for go to boys. fucking Corona yeah, boys, little cigar boys. company and shit. You know what I'm we saying? We do big man team. Yeah, bro. Like we have a vibe, but Fact. it's. Oh! Besides that, bro, I prefer to I prefer to live in the country, bro. People yeah, mind their business a little nice. more. You know what I'm saying? You have your privacy a lot more. Yeah. If somebody's on your property, it better be for a good fucking reason. Facts. We don't like them Latinos down yeah. here, boy. <laughs> yo, I went to Get I went spick ass yeah, out of here. Yo, I went out, bro, and I was at fucking uh, this redneck bar. I'm not gonna say anything because I'm cool with the owner. He let me smoke hookah. I actually broke the fucking hookah. Wow. Yeah. Wow. We were, weren't we just talking nah, about that was breaking not, everything he touches? Nah, but, <laughs> yeah, bro. Yeah, real. Yeah, Shout out to him. Yeah, it was a fail. It was a fail. I like him. But That's bad. nah, I was dancing with mom and fucking it felt you know whatever you, you said fuck it man. I didn't buy it uh, fuck you no no I did you buy it you buy it I did buy it oh well fuck it I bought it fuck you I paid for it I'll break it again I bought it I bought it I bought it it was like 30 bucks whatever I took it out so at least my it was dog said 30 bucks ain't shit damn your wife is I ass I wiped my ear thank you but anyways I went out to this bar and shout out to the owner man I'm yeah, not gonna shout say out the name. to the yeah, round of applause yeah. to the anonymous yo, boy. We yeah, school with him. Hey, hey, <laughs> yo, we went to school with him. You hear me? We went to school with him. No, no, I know exactly who the fuck you talking about. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this, you know, this guy's guy. a piece of don't shit. Don't out with this guy. Yeah, yeah in fact, you don't want to give nobody nah, props. No, nah, but the girl was like, <laughs> the girl was like, oh, fucking. Some guy was trying to give her a tip, and it was like change. I understand where she's coming from because he's a bartender. Like, you're not gonna give a change. To the girl, like as a tip, like oh, money, so he money. kept the bills and then he, <laughs> yeah, he like, and then she was set. like, I'm yeah, not. Like, <laughs> she's like, I'm not gonna keep your fucking change in pesos. You can keep that. Well, you know what, what I would have told that. Yeah. You know what I would have told that fucking whore. This is I would have like, hey, bitch, how about you go scrub the fucking toilet then for your five dollars <laughs> hour and get the fuck out my face? I'll give you fucking homegirl over here a tip. Hey, yeah. hey, bro, get a better job. Yeah. That's hey, bro, the tip I got All that for you. peso, peso shit. Yeah. Fuck you. Pesos. Yeah. Nigga, you the one working here for like child labor fucking for <laughs> meth. wages You're the and one shit. that's working here for meth. Nah, fat. All this pays is for your weekly meth. <laughs> nah, nah. I don't want to eat it. Nah, nah. Nah, it was it's a right, good though. time. Just it was a little mess, though. Yeah, but yeah, yeah man. It's fucking, um, <laughs> wow, that's trippy. Um, yeah, that's just fucking. Cool, this guy man. has the attention span of like a two year old. Because I have a four, I have a three year old, and she pays more attention to me when I speak than John does. Todd squirrel, I'm telling you, yeah, he's a squirrel face ass <laughs> nigga. That's why I had to close the shades. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna be out there trying to fucking yeah, chase it through the window, <laughs> jump out through the window. Hey, bro. Amen, hey, amen. Most of the time, I hope y'all know that I'm really fucked up when I'm running no, no. this podcast. Hey, yeah, listen, bro, we're usually super. Mess. Hey, look. Round of applause for everybody that's litty titty with us. If you're not litty like your titties, then what you doing? Shut it off. What you doing, man? What you doing? What you doing up in this bitch? All right. What are we on here? Uh, we're about like maybe like four or five minutes away. I don't yeah. believe Johnny's yeah, a liar. John, John don't know what the fuck we be doing. He's the director, so if you guys like, he's the director. Didn't know. By the way, by the way, I'm directing this fucking music video. BTW, song, uh, you know yeah, I mean? John's dropping Hello. his music it's video. Sun, sun light, sun light, nothing crazy. Round of applause to my dog. Yo, shout out to the people. that song though. Hey, no, yeah. for real, listen, guys, no cap. No that cap song yeah. that these niggas got right here. Be on the lookout for it, bro. Because that's just going to be playing locally. I we know. Here. I already here. know it. This guy's the only local I know. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm local. No, Oof. I'm not crazy, bro. Damn, I Damn, just got that. My dog just... <laughs> he got offended. He Yo, got, I offended. got get offended. I'm not crazy, man. I'm a fucking chill motherfucker. I'm out here. We from the fucking 386. Drop a beat. Let John go in. It sounded like he was hey, going to rap. Man, Drop look, something. Look, look, look. We I'll got something there. Right Let's see what we got. I don't know, man. Let's it's see. It's the Yo. same old fucking shit. Right here. It's Yo, the only beat we got. Hell, I can't believe this shit. <laughs> I'm tired of this beat. Hey, you know I'll tell you what. We'll switch it up. Look, look, look. What do we got? We got shit. We got shit. Oh, shit. Let me Oh, what the fuck? What? <laughs> Come on, Johnny. Hit it. Yo, he just called me out, bro. Hit it. Hey. hey. What the fuck? Give him a sample for the music Yo. video. Yo. Oh, oh shit. Nah, bring it right there. Let me go a cappella. Uh, right. All right, go ahead, go ahead. Uh, acapella. Let's hear it. Yo, yo, Jay, give me a beat. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> 
Yeah, okay. Yo, uh. welcome to the podcast. We just chilling and we on there. Hell, we smoking and we cognac. I don't give a fuck what you say. I'm just smoking weed anyway. I just want to get it every day. I don't give a fuck. If you don't press the subscribe button, I don't give a fuck. You can keep it moving. I don't give a fuck. You can duck. Uh, and I'm going to keep moving like a duck. Oh. Uh. <laughs>